Hey guys, Picano here, bringing you guys another GTA 5 video, and in today's video, what I want to do is start off by saying we have two upcoming huge GTA 5 racing events that are coming up in the next week or a couple of weeks from now, and it's just going to be incredible. So what I'm going to do in this video is just talk through all the you know main features and what's happening, and you know things like the turnouts and the races and you know the specific event details so in the background we've actually got some insane comet racing it's actually probably one of the best battles um, in a comet I've had uh, I don't race a comet too often but it was really nice to see um, and obviously the track details will be linked down below um, and as you can probably see I'm using a different camera angle but that'll be explained in another video um, and what this video is going to be about is we know multi-class endurance uh, championship is coming up um, early March, 6th of March um, and it's going to be run on all three platforms, PS4, Xbox, PC. Obviously I'm participating on the PS4 um, and this is a Bruffy um, event, it's a huge event and last year was just insane um, watching it back, some of the battles and because it's one race split into three different car types, you've got GT1, GT2, GT3, everyone has their own battle, everyone has their own race, it's a proper endurance race, different car classes. So I'll be in GT1 as you can see now, spreadsheet on screen with all the different teams and all the different drivers that you can see on here, so in my team, Devon Weston, which if you haven't already, go check out the trailer which um, I posted uh, yesterday, I'll leave a link to that. Um, I've got Shred, Shred Ninja, and I've got Caton Honda as well on there as representing GT3, and obviously Shred representing GT2. So that's my class. Um, and as you can see, the others we've got other people that I race with, like Ryan and Shaggy and Mike and um, various different other people, Doodle and things like that. Um, so it's going to be an absolutely intense racing environment. Um, and you know standard racing procedures apply like you've got to wait for someone if you take someone out accidentally you know it's going to be an hour and a half race which is just going to be insane the first race is actually Blaine County 24 now to be honest that is a hard track to do for an hour and a half just because if it's it's got the last bit near like Trevor's bit air, airfield, which is the bit you see now on screen in this comic battle. This is not the actual trap, but it's the same area. It's really, really intense, um, and it's really, really hard to keep focus for an hour and a half on a track like that because anything can happen. And what's most um, unusual is it's in a, it's well for me it's in a Z type. It's going to be sports classics, but it's going to be in a Z type for me and the other people in GT1. And that car's got no traction on the back whatsoever. It's as big as the Titanic. It's as fat as the Titanic, and it just it's so unpredictable at times. But yeah, that's that's what's going to be the first race. And obviously I'll be streaming the race entirely when it does drop in early March um, but as you can see all the details will be linked for that event down below in the description so we'll jog that out um, straight away so that's multi class endurance uh, championship like I said that's possibly one of the biggest racing events that can happen in this game um, in terms of what I'm going to be playing but in just terms of a whole there's no other event really that's as big as as more organized as that um, so that's going to be pretty insane the next event which is going to be take place uh, as from uh, Friday, this coming Friday, um, is going to be something called Sport uh, GT. So Sports GT Racing Series. This is what, actually what I'm uh, using now. So I've been participating in the Comet. Um, and my driver is Albertino, and he's my teammate, and we're representing the Comet. Um, so what it does is basically you've got a playlist. I believe it's eight tracks at the top of my top of my head and each team has a car that they represent now this is between the Massacre, this is between the Felts, so Comet um, well, so we've got Jester and we've got the Elegy without the spoiler just to make it a bit more interesting and a bit more fair um, but basically those cars are assigned to drivers and there's about 24 drivers and like I said 
The Comet actually won last year's uh, event, so the Comet came out on top, and it's actually not a bad car to race. If you if you nail this car, it's, you get some epic battles, as you can see on screen now. But yeah, this is going to be another upcoming GTA 5 event, which is starting next week, next Friday. Um, so pay attention for that. I'll be streaming that, and I'll be putting a uh, event schedule on your sub box. So pay attention to that. Um, but yeah, GTA 5 is really kicking in. And remember when I made that video about if GTA 5 racing dead? Quite a, about just before Christmas, no, it was November, December time. Then the GTA 5 racing dead. No, it's not. It's getting bigger. It's getting stronger. It's getting more competitive, more drivers. Like I said, I'll be doing a video on why I'm using this dif uh, different camera angle because things change. You know, things change um, as the years go by. I've been playing this game for two years straight and. I've experienced different routes and now I'm trying to go into different options and to see which works best. Um, and but yeah, it was it was interesting to see. So make sure you pay attention to those events and like I said, all the details of the sports GT will be linked down below as well. So uh, that's interesting. Another thing to mention as well is we hit 8,000 subscribers, which is Absolutely insane, we're actually nearly 8,060 at the moment, so that's just incredible. Um, can't thank you guys enough, it's been so quick, I mean I think I did 7,000 like just last month, so that is, the progression on that is insane, and for each and every one that leaves a comment, leaves a like, it's, you know, it's good because it gets the video out there to more people and it gets the videos more active and, you know, people have different perspectives on it and different ideas and that's what's great about doing this sort of thing online. But that's not, you know, like I said, that's not always been about. main thing is, you know, GTA 5 is the game that I'm most passionate about is getting stronger, it's getting better and a lot more races are coming to the game you know we're seeing people that to be honest with you I've never seen before and you know they're participating in things like you know uh, GT1 and GT2 and just getting into these different events with different crews you know Apex crew um, Nodo which to be fair I've never been assigned with Nodo I've never joined their crew I've raced with them I always you know I've always raced with them I've just never been set to there but because I'm not a dickhead, um, you know, I can get invited to events like this, which is which is good because that's how it should be. You you know, you don't want to be f you don't want to be limited in terms of you know your events and things like that. Just stay a positive attitude and just stick by it. Because at the end of the day, if you if you're a dick in this game, you're just a dick for life. Um, but yeah, that's uh, that's something to see. But yeah, guys, I hope uh, you guys enjoyed this video and. Just make sure, make sure you stick around for these events because they're going to be incredible. And if you want to sign up for these events, obviously they're completely closed because they are private events where you have to sign up, go through a process, go through a practice, qualifying, go through um, assigning a car and assigning a teammate and things like that. So, you, you know, you've got to do that, but always keep an eye on the Apex or the Nodo forums um, to, you know, have a watch list of all the events that are coming up. I'll leave a link to all those in the description below. There's going to be a lot of links in this video, but make sure you check them out down below. So, yeah, guys, that's going to be interesting. Prepare for more videos this week. Got a lot of videos coming. And, you know, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like. Subscribe if you are new. Thank you for the support lately, and I'll see you in the next one, guys. Cheers.